Your girl hair is straight. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, this is amazing. Like, do you see the view that we have right going right here going on? So uh yesterday was a crazy day. Um, it literally took us 12 hours to travel, so we did not get here till literally 12, 11 30, 12 p.m. We missed seeing this in the daytime, so this is our first time seeing it um, bright out. It's 7:30 a.m. Um, we last night just <coughs> excuse me, what the heck was that? <laughs> last night we um, had a little campfire situation going on, and had like one mics hard, and then went to sleep. So, um, but yeah, this is so cute. So we have like a little glamping situation. So, all right, we're about to finish loading up, and then once we get on the road, I'll see you guys once we get there and everything. Y'all, look at this. We're not even at the park yet, but wow. So oh, cool. All right, so we made it to Rainbow Point. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Wow. You want me to take the picture? Oh, thank you. I'm recording. Oh. <laughs> thank you, though. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we at um, Nature Bridge now. So this is how this one looks. It's not as high as the other one. Um, this has steeper. Like more rock. Look down there. All right, y'all, so we have made it. We was a little lost, but we made it to the um, horseback riding part, so I changed my outfit. I changed, and uh, yeah, it's about like a 90 minute trail. I'm gonna ask them if I can take some pictures. I don't know, so we'll see. Guys, so we are on the trail. This is so much fun, like, it's a nice, slow, steady trail. Um, never been horseback riding as an adult, so. Um, and I'm all the way in the back. Good, so I don't feel like I gotta do anything right. 
um, it was really easy for me to get on my horse. I thought it was going to be difficult, but it wasn't. So I was like, cool. And um, my horse is Rooster. This is my horse. And he's got his own little vibe, okay? Like, he do what he want to do. <laughs> but he's taking care of me. So I am, the smile says it all. took showers I'm so tired my legs hurt so bad um I I think I did like pony ride or something like that when I was younger but never like a big horse so that was technically my first time horseback riding and it was so much fun the views was crazy I cannot believe we got that close to the edge like that it was no gate no nothing like y'all was a little scared and my horse Loki had like a personality and was like a lone wolf and he was doing whatever he wanted to do so he was getting a little too close for me and I was like buddy like <laughs> you gonna have to move back so but oh, I feel so much better about to find somewhere for dinner and that will be our day so yeah about to chill for a second it's dinner time and then today all right y'all so we're at uh, central wood fire pizzeria it's so cute in here and um, they have a riesling that's made here so you know So we definitely about to share this. <laughs> oh, thank you. You're welcome. Do oh, you guys still wow. want a few minutes for everything else? Yes, please. <laughs> and then we got the bottle of wine right there. So, yummy.
I love this little thing right here. So I got some photos and um, now we're about to pack and get on the road. Um, check out is at 12, but we're probably gonna leave here within an, within an hour or so um, because we have like an hour drive to get to the first canyon. And then we're gonna try to hit three canyons today and then go to our next Airbnb. So that's the plan. Um, we're still gonna shoot to try to get Zion Park. So tonight at five, we're gonna get on the website and try to get it. Yesterday it was sold out within four minutes. I think it was like eight time slots and they all sold out. So we're gonna try again. And yeah, so cross your fingers for us that we at least get to get Zion and so we could do that tomorrow um but let's see what today brings a lot more views and stuff like I can't wait to see like all of these parks I've seen them only in pictures and stuff um obviously duh but <laughs> what am I talking about I'll see y'all later we made it to the first spot so this is called Snow Canyon and it's a lot of really big mountains around here <laughs> But like, we're not, we're at the bottom of it. Like I feel like yesterday we were at the top. Like today we're at the bottom looking up at everything. So it's not as intimidating no. being a little lower today. <laughs> yesterday was pretty crazy being up that high. But this is the view so far. This is where we're going. Getting real now. Yeah, this is so freaking dope. Like, man. Never seen nothing like this in my life. I thought Miami was dope coming from Baltimore, you know. But this, y'all gotta come to Utah, man see stuff other other than just your backyard you know even if you're not into like sleeping in the woods and all that stuff you can get a nice airbnb or hotel but you gotta come see this rocking the art is dope y'all got a cop Boy Dez, really talented artist in Miami. He got clothes and stuff. He um, customizes stuff. So let me get off because it's a little hill. See y'all at the top. We just came down this freaking hill. Oh my God, it was crazy. But we almost there. I had to put the hair up. Scott's cave is this way. We go the wrong way. I think we went the wrong way, y'all. Hold on. All right, y'all. So obviously we found it. We've had to climb, but we're almost there. We see some actual steps, which means, hold on. I gotta do this shit. Oh, <laughs> which means 
we're almost there so it's that hole right there that's where we're going right now we are coming up on an hour of hiking there's a few other people up there too I got it Alrighty. Oh yeah, the rest is there. Oh, we're gonna be Gucci after we do this. This is definitely our freaking workout for the day. And we still got another spot to go. But that has water there, so that's gonna cool us off. Y'all, we just came all the way up these stairs. Oh my God. Jesus. Okay, we almost there, y'all. Yeah, we made it. Look at this. Look how high we are. So I found a place to shoot right up in here. Oh my god, y'all. These pictures about to be fire. Oh my gosh, this is so bright. Hold on. Can you see me? Look at my outfit. I just shot, so we're about to shoot one more and then go get some tacos. <laughs> Alright, y'all, we had to take a break. Um, I started, um, feeling really sick because I haven't eaten and I was taking, I was trying to reshoot this, this outfit I wore yesterday, that's why I have it on again. We're going to call it a day and stop to eat. We're not going to do the other place today. Oh, I can't even hold this camera straight. <sighs> My hands are shaking. Of course, y'all know we got tacos. That's what we like to eat. <laughs> and um, I got the biggest Fanta ever. I was so thirsty. Yeah. So after this, we're going to go to the road, go to the next Airbnb. And that, uh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm not a little bit of a Number two. Oh, here's the food. Two soft tacos, a chicken and a carne asada. Right here. Right here. Thank you. And three street tacos, right? Sure. Side of avocado. Yeah. Thank you so much. I'm going to take this number. You guys enjoy, all right? Thank you. All right, y'all. It's time to eat. Peace out. Look at that. No, don't focus on the dirty one. No, focus on so much better now actually getting a little hungry again we're in the car on the way to the airbnb we have like what an hour left about an hour left and yeah a nice bubble bath this place has a nice tub so that is needed and then just kind of chill we oh I didn't tell y'all we got the tickets for Zion Park. We hopped on there at five o'clock. I had an account and he had an account and we just like <laughs> hurried up. So we got the tickets. I'm so happy. So we're able to still see this place because apparently it's like everything. So alright y'all, I'll see you guys once we get to <laughs> Feels so refreshed. This was 
by far the best bed. So it's like the beds just got better every day. <laughs> um, the Airbnbs got better every day. So we got some amazing sleep. Like literally slept all through the night until it was time to get up. We fell asleep like maybe 12, 31 o'clock and woke up at, well I first woke up at like six something, then went back to sleep. Um, so yep, Zion Park today. <laughs> I should have brought another pair of leggings, but I rinsed mine out last night and hung them up to dry. So, um, cause yesterday they got a little dirty cause some of the rocks I had to like sit down and come down like, but, um, so that's the plan. And then we're headed to, um, somewhere near there to stay the night tonight. And then tomorrow will be our Salt Lake City day to explore Salt Lake. Before we leave, we have a really late flight at 11.59, so we have all day to um, explore, eat some good food, like, be a part of, like, the city life versus, like, out in the nature and stuff. So, um, we're getting packed up right now, and then we'll be on the road. guys we are inside the park right now okay we're trying to find somewhere to park there's a lot of like cool shops and everything in here they have restaurants in here I wasn't expecting it to be like this to be honest <laughs> but uh, they even have hotels in here so you can literally stay right inside the park uh, which is cool. So once we find parking and find the shuttle, um, I'll let you guys know what's next. Look, see? He almost fell because he don't have a stick. I know, we're going to put everything away. All right, y'all, so we are at the Narrows. We're about to walk in here. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. You done wet? No. What you do? Make it tight. And his blood is freezing. I can feel it a little. Not really. <laughs> Y'all look at this. This is so freaking cool. So we got sticks and we walking in the water. Hey y'all, so I wanted to pop on here really quick and do a voiceover. I wasn't able to get as much footage this part right here as I wanted to. I really wished I had a GoPro. At certain points, the water came up to our waist, but obviously I was too scared to pull out the phone or the camera. So, but yeah, this is a must visit if you ever go to Zion Park. I can't even get it off. So the struggle is real. It's like, oh, there it is. <laughs> hey guys, it's been a few hours <laughs> since we last talked to y'all. Um, we left the park. Went and got some Thai food and checked into our last Airbnb. I'm going to put the little clippies right here. I don't know what happened to my camera, but I had it on the wrong setting, so it looked pitch black, so I didn't get <coughs> um, the Airbnb when we drove up. So I'll get it in the morning and then show you guys uh, what it looks like. It's really cute. And um, tomorrow is Salt Lake City Day. It's the last day. 
So we're gonna be pretty much in the city tomorrow. Um, and that'll be it. So I'm excited to actually see Salt Lake and see what they have going on. Like it's gonna be totally different from what we've been doing because we've been like out in the boondocks. So um, try maybe a nice restaurant and just vibe. So we'll see you guys in the morning. So this is the back of my Airbnb. So I'm shooting right here this morning. Oh my God, this worked out perfectly. Like when I tell you guys, I haven't had to really like, um, when I tell you guys I haven't had to stress out or go far for locations, Utah, Utah is where it's at. Now I see why all the Utah bloggers have so much great content, cause it's so easy out here. So I'm done for the day, about to change up, get packed up, and let's roll up. Dress is from Shein, of course. We just checked out of the room, well, the Airbnb, and we're about to go get some food. Salt Lake, here we come. Mm, 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 mm. I'm excited. Uh, y'all so first stop is oh well this this car but <laughs> the red iguana this is supposed to be the best mexican food here in salt lake so we're about to try it out all right y'all so we found a park Got a few hours to kill, so we're gonna chill here at this park. Right her, like the way you do that right there. <laughs> Three hours later. So y'all, we had to go find another place because the bayou requires um, full vaccination to even enter their restaurant, <laughs> which is kind of crazy. So y'all, we found this um, cool little spot. Um, it has like kebabs and lamb and stuff like that. Um, it's not really like food food, it's kind of like street food, like stuff like that, but this will do. Um, we don't really have much of an option. The, what was it called? The, Down the street and found this. But, um, I'm excited. I'm hungry. And 